Today in class we used Google Drive to collaborate on a presentation on pregnancy. I'm going to show you how to embed a presentation such as this one from Google Drive into your websites. So this is the presentation that we all worked on today where we talked about changes in a woman's body and changes to the baby during the first, second, and third trimester. So if I wanted to embed this on either WordPress, Blogger, or Weebly, what I need to do is go to File, in File, you're going to see a tab that says Publish to the Web. I'm going to click on Publish to the Web, and then you're going to see where it says Document Link, and then underneath that you see Embed Code. So this is the embed code that I need in order to embed it onto my website. So first, let's look at WordPress. So if I'm in WordPress, and this is my WordPress screen, I'm going to go to Add New. So I add new post. Here I'm going to put in my post title just that this is a collaborative presentation in Google Drive and I'm embedding it on a website and then I can put in whatever text I would like to put in here which I have already written out in a Word document so I can just copy it and paste it in and then I want to put in that embedded presentation so I need to go back to that embed code I need to copy so control C or command C if you're on a Mac and then I want to put in that embed code. What I need to do here in WordPress is I need to switch the view from visual to text. So if I go to text view, this is where you see all the strange looking code. And then I'm going to hit control V and paste in that embed. Now when I go back to visual, I'm going to see the place that are for this. Now if I hit publish, and I give it just a minute to publish to the web, when it pops up, I should see that collaborative presentation. So right here, it'll scroll through each of those. So it's very easy to embed the presentation into WordPress. So let's check out that same thing in Blogger. If I go to my Blogger site, this is what it looks like. Now I want to go and I want to actually add a new post. So I need to go to my dashboard and I'm going to go to write a new post. Here I'm going to put in that title again that I put in on my WordPress site. So I have again this written in a Word document, so I'm just copying and pasting the title and the text. And now I want to actually embed it, so I need to go back and get that embed code again. I copy that embed code, go to Blogger. This is an HTML code, so up here in Blogger you see Compose, you see HTML. I'm going to switch to HTML. Now I'm going to need to scroll down to the very bottom of this and I'm going to hit paste. Now when I go back to compose, you should see it pop up right there. I'm going to hit publish and then we'll give it a moment again. And once it's loaded, I go to view that post and you will see it right here. So once again, you see the title I put in, you see the description, and then right here is that presentation we worked on in class. So let's try the same thing in Weebly. So if I go over here to Weebly, Weebly works a little bit different, but let's say I want to put it here on this front page. What I need to do is I'm going to drag in a text box. That way I can put in my description that I previously wrote. So here, copy, I paste in my description, and then when you scroll down in Weebly, you're going to see a box that actually says Embed Code. So I'm going to take this box that says Embed Code, I'm going to drag it onto my screen. Now I need to go back to that presentation one more time. I'm going to copy that Embed Code by hitting Control c go back to Weebly, and then I'm putting in that Embed Code, Control z v I can decide whether I want it to be centered. I'm going to go ahead and center it, click off of it, and there you go. It is embedded into Weebly. So that was a quick introduction of how to take a collaborative presentation or any presentation you do in Google Drive and then embedding it into either WordPress, Blogger, or Weebly.